In the first lecture of Feeders 101, What is a Process Feeder? Tom Rickenbach of Catron discusses the key elements of process feeding. Typical process feeders employ two modes of operation, volumetric and gravimetric. Also discussed are two types of feeding formats, continuous and batch. Included are control strategies to feed product, such as PID, or proportional, integral, and derivative, weigh belt feeding, and loss and weight feeding. We will examine how each type of action in the PID control method achieves a controlled flow rate. Along with this, Tom describes one type of flow sensor that employs the Coriolis effect to provide a mass flow to a PID control loop. The flow meter's feedback is compared to the set point, so that it may make adjustments as necessary to control the amount of product flowing into the process line. With weigh belt feeders, the belt load times the belt speed equals mass flow. The operating principles behind weigh belt feeding are demonstrated using a Catron feeder. The operating principles of loss and weight feeding are also demonstrated using a Catron loss and weight feeder with a color graphic interface. As the name implies, a loss and weight feeder measures the loss of a product's weight and controls its discharge accordingly. Tom discusses why it is important to understand feeder accuracy and how to test and verify that a scale is working properly. He concludes the session by discussing various application examples. What is a process feeder includes a quiz to help ensure your complete understanding of the concept.